What's up guys? Welcome to Jukebox Comics. My name is Brandon and today is April 25th, I believe. Uh, April 25th, new comic book day, which is always amazing. So what I'm going to do is go through the comic books that I bought, uh, that I got today. First off, we're going to start with Rick and Morty. Number 37, this is the B variant, uh, the Pickle Rick variant, which is absolutely amazing. I think is just hilarious. Pickle Rick! And then we've got Aliens Dust to Dust, B Virgin, B, the B variant Virgin cover, which is absolutely gorgeous. This is just a gorgeous, gorgeous cover. And that's it, that's all I've got for uh, the variants Independence today and here comes Daisy are you gonna come up say hi say hi we're gonna move on to DC I only have three DC books today which is very surprising start off with silencer number four just the regular cover there's only one cover for silencer it's a great book silencer and then Terrifics number three, which I think is absolutely amazing. Great book, great story, and great art. And then we've got Detective Comics 979. We're getting close to that thousand mark. Uh, we're only 20 away, which is pretty amazing. Well, 21 now, but still awesome. Um, I'm loving Detective Comics right now. It's an awesome story. It's a great book. So that's DC. Yeah. For Marvel, we've got the first free Marvel Rising number zero. Um, I'm actually excited for this book to come out. Art Germ's doing a variant, and it's got Carol Danvers on the front, and it looks amazing. And then we've got the Thanos 13 fourth printing. I just picked up one of those just because I actually got one of my LCSs to uh, special order it for me. And then we've got the Thanos Annual, number one. Which I've heard actually has something big in it. I haven't read it yet, but we shall see. And then we've got Exiles, number two. Number two, the debut of the Valkyrie. I love Valkyrie. I think it's awesome. And then we've got the Scotty Young looking character over here with the Wolverine. X that is Wolverine. It's like Kid Wolverine. I don't even know. I haven't read Exiles, number one yet, so... I'm not sure. Anywho. And then we've got all new Wolverine 34. And then a book from last week, which is World War Hulk 2, The Incredible Hulk 715. This is a really cool um, the book, sucks. It sucks big time. However, can you not, please? And then I got Lockjaw number three. This book absolutely sucks. I don't read it. I read the first one and it did not please me whatsoever. But I grabbed it because it's an amazing Fantasy 15 uh, cover swap. That's it. That's the only reason. I thought it was awesome. That's why I grabbed it. And then we have The Mighty Thor 706. <sighs> Spoiler alert, if you didn't know... Already, 705, the Mighty Thor died. Uh, sorry, Jane Foster died. Um, yeah, I don't know if you knew that or not, but uh, there you go. And then we've got the finale of No Surrender, Avengers No Surrender. That's the Avengers 690, part 16, which I think is pretty dang cool uh, cover. I think it's pretty sweet. And then we've got the Venomized number four, the uh, Bagley variant, which is awesome. That's the only ones I get. I don't get any of the normal covers. The normal cover actually had Venomized Thanos, like, just choking out Venom, which was kind of cool. But I just want those connecting covers. And then the big book, I guess this would be the big book for the week. Hunt for Wolverine, number one. Well, it's a one shot, but number one. And then I've got two variants for this one. I got this variant, which is the uh, preview variant, I believe. And then we've got the Marco Chiquetto, Chiquetto 
a young gun variant so those are both awesome i've been i've been excited for these books because i do like wolverine a lot carnage is my favorite character of all time but wolverine is up there so my cover of the week let's just take a minute here and uh go check that out okay so i picked three but i'm gonna pick one out of the three so the first one Pickle Rick. The second one was Aliens Dust to Dust number one virgin cover. And of course, the Hunt for Wolverine uh, Young Gun. Now, for me to pick one of these. I'm going with the Hunt for Wolverine. I have to. It's beautiful. But so is this. Okay, you know what? Screw it. I'm doing two again. We're doing two this week again. Marco Giacchetto, good job. I forgot, I don't know who did that, but good job. Y'all covers are absolutely beautiful and amazing. So, that's my haul for the week of April 25th. I have a huge, well not really huge, I have a big lot of key issue, back issue haul video coming out soon but i'm gonna go live within the next couple days i haven't figured out what day yet and i'm going to show them off there um so make sure you stay tuned i will definitely post something about my live shows and when i'm gonna do them but until then make sure you guys subscribe comment Give me a big old thumbs up and comment down below what your favorite cover of the week was. I'd love to know. Um, so put a big old comment down there. I'd like to give a huge shout out to Comic Vantage. His channel is absolutely amazing and him and I, I have chit chats all the time. Not really chit chats, kind of. Well, whenever I'm live, he's always, he's always there. Um... So make sure you guys check out his channel. I'm sure you already have. But just do me a favor and uh, go check him out. Alright guys, thanks for watching. Hope you have a good day.